Yo, what's it going? I suck at 365 and today I am doing a review of um a new football shoes I bought because my other shoes are coming out of the sole so I've you know got it some new shoes. Today we have Patrick L Esprit do sports. I probably pronounced that wrong. So I'm not in my usual place, so this time Darius can't pelt me with a roller masking tape or oh, and I'm probably not gonna drop it. So let's see. Um of course, I set my that beautiful green. Hashtag green is my favorite color. Most of y'all should um already know that. But picking these shoes, boy, it was like, I don't know. You know, decided to go for new things and see how it work out. Dewey Games coming up, you know, got to get them new shoes. So it's actually really soft. It's a eight because I have big feet. Hehe, <laughs> wink, wink. <laughs> The inside is like kind of cushion, not as much as the other one. At least the sole has a lot of cushion, but the sides is not much. But you know, socks and stuff will deal with that. The back is kind of hard-ish because of the material. And then again, it's new. It also has this synthetic piece, like kind of like the Adidas Predator, but more of like a bootleg version. Uh, it has crazy spin here, trying to get to focus. Okay, yeah, there. Crazy spin. So it has a synthetic part coming across the um, side, a little bit on the top, and then a little bit at the edge here. It also have this part, which I assume is probably for trapping the ball. You know, when you get kick and you want to take an outside touch, or you know you want to line up the ball with the outside of your foot. So I'm guessing that's probably what this part is. So yeah, again, kind of reminds me of the Predator LZ Lethal Zones, because you know they had stuff like this on the shoes. Now on to the uh, bottom. It's really nice. It has this kind of groove, these grooves along the uh, side. It has the Patrick again. Another good thing is like, as you can see, it has a tack there and it has two on the top here. So that's kind of going to help the shoe, going to help the sole while the studs stay onto the shoe um, longer because that was the problem I was having with my other shoes. Like at the side here, it started to come off and you know, if I applied a little force, the the studs would have come off completely and the studs in this one kind of place weird ish um it have one going across here the regular four at the back and then it kind of have two with the kind of t structure if you look at it this way it look like a t so that's kind of interesting i want to see how that'll help me move around as i'll be running and stuff and then it have the normal ones up here and if you can see it has the l esprit du sport i'm probably really pronouncing that wrong but other than that the shoe feels really nice a kind of soft leather material back in the day that's what most shoes were made out of and it's probably gonna last longer than the other night because they're more for um quality over quantity you know fashion over function kind of thing haha <laughs> quote of the video fashion over function has like two stripes probably just to make it not as boring as it would have be a flush blue here as it is at the side here they could have put the two stripes here as well but you know other than that the shoes really nice gonna be training with it today and then I'll put probably a rating at the end of the video, which is probably going to go up maybe Friday. Today is Monday, so it might go up on Friday. So, you know, it's really cool. Uh, tested this one. That's why the laces are undone. So, yeah, um, that's the Patrick. I don't know what the name of the shoe is. Um, I'll have to Google that and find out. So, I hope you all enjoy, you know, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you all next time. Ugh. Love, peace, and chicken grease.